try to draw a common tangent to a given circles of unequal radius. Means two unequal, two circles are given with unequal radius. We are asked to draw a common tangent. Okay, let us see how to do. First, uh, let us draw two circle first. Let me bring it here. Okay. So this is the first circle that I have drawn and then another circle at any location I can do doesn't matter. Before that I what I will do I will uh, connect these two points then it will be easy for me otherwise like this connecting connecting giving a connection. Okay. Come here. Going to make another circle here. And I will reduce the circle diameter. So I am drawing a reduced diameter. Okay. So now I have two circles. Okay, you can give their name. Uh, let us say the first circle I am giving a name of center is. Q I have given and this circle center. Okay, anything you can give as for here. Now we have to draw another circle from point uh, from this center Q. The radius of that circle will be uh, the radius of this minus radius of the other one. Okay, let us say the radius are given like this. Say the first circle radius is just uh, to understand it properly. I am giving some name of this let us say that this is the radius of this circle and with a different color so this is the radius and this radius i am giving say radius so this one is as r1 okay this is r1 and so this is another one which i am doing it and let us say the radius here is r okay so let us write it here as R1 and this, this one is as R1. Now I have to draw another circle with radius R1 minus R2. Now how to get that R1 minus R2 with the compass? It's very simple. I will, I will get it. Okay. So to do that, first what I will do? I will take the measure this uh, radius here. What is this radius? So this is the The radius here okay that's fixed now get the radius of the other one this is fine okay so just uh, to make it clear what i have done get the radius of the other one so what is the radius here the center close it this is the radius of the other one now bring it mark it here Again, we get the LF proper center. Just uh, do a small marking, maybe with a defined color and do a small marking. Okay. Nothing like that. Okay. So take it out, go it here, this intersection, and bring it here. And see where, where it is marking. Okay. So this is the radius R1 minus R2. Okay. Now again, you bring it here. Bring it here at the center and draw a circle. Now this circle I will do this one. Okay. So, can draw the radius of the so I can draw this one. Okay. So this blue color one is the completed circle with the radius of R1 minus R2. So I will show you how understood this very clearly how to draw this. Okay. Now from point P I have to draw a tangent to the circle of with radius R1 minus R2. So how uh, to draw that circle you already know that already we have done it earlier okay i'll follow the same steps here okay so for that what i have to do i have to make uh, the center at o and at, and this radius is already already available to us okay uh, now what you have to do you have to join this point q and this p which is already i have done it okay. now with op okay with qp with qp as the radius then you have to draw a circle here okay 
so for that I am maybe I can take it or otherwise you know it already we have done it earlier so what you can do is you can make it open it up and you can make this covering here so no problem uh, already we have done it we already we know how to draw the tangents okay so I'll I'll draw the tangent uh, with a different uh, scale and I'll come back I have drawn the tangent. Now I have to uh, join this uh, point Q and the point T and extend it so that it can bisect the main circle, say at any point A. Okay, I am just joining it and extending it. Okay, let us say this is bisected this uh, point at A. Okay, so write down here A. Okay, this is at point A. Okay, the, the OT is produced, this is QT is produced and it is bisected the circle at, uh, cut at the circle at point A. Now, through point, through P, draw a line PB. So, this is P and through this point P, I will draw a line PB parallel to this QA. Now, you know how to draw the parallel line. Okay, draw a, draw a line parallel to this QA through point P, which will be PB and that will cut this the circle at point B. Okay. Now draw a line through A and B. After that, you draw a line through A and B. Then this line will be the required time. Similar thing can be done on the other side. Okay. Uh, I am doing it. Okay. So to do, to, you know how to draw the parallel line. So I will just try to draw a parallel line here. I have drawn a parallel line of QT at this point P that is PB okay and then I have and this B is cutting the R2 circle at the point B now then I have connected this line AB this line AB is nothing but the common tangent for two, for two circle with different radius just quick summary once again I am telling quickly what I did I first I have drawn a circle with the center Q and then I have drawn another circle with P, this P circle, center circle has a radius R2, the other one is having a radius R1. Now then uh, what I have done, I have done another circle uh, using the center Q with the radius R2 minus R1 minus R2. So R1 minus R2. Okay. Now uh, this, once it is done, now with the center Q, I have drawn a tangent from a point which is outside, outside this and that is nothing but, nothing but the from point P. From point P I have drawn the tangent, already I told you how to do this, you know Okay, so I have drawn this tangent. Now this Q2 I have connected and uh, have extended it. This is uh, cutting this circle radius R1 at a point A. Now this line QA is there and then I have drawn a parallel line of QA through point P, a PB line which is cutting the 
circle with radius r2 at point b now the, i have drawn in the, the, the 2.8 in similar practice can be done in the opposite side also so in, in this is nothing but a radius i am writing it and radius so here is r1 minus okay. so this one is our required tangent so okay. you can do it the same process here i can show the tangent and here i can extend it Okay. So this is how you can draw the radius common common tangent to the circles with anything. Okay.